Good morning, guys, and God bless you. Carlos here with Serrano Mobile Detail in Dallas, Texas. Um, so today we are out here in Frisco. I'm actually going to be doing two vehicles. These are my um, these are my regular clients. Uh, I've been serving, seeing them for about, I think, going on three years. Uh, I could be wrong, uh, but this one's going to be like what I call my maintenance detail package uh, it's gonna have all the interior vacuumed out really well steam clean all the interior uh, remove minor staining that the leather has obviously uh, the customers have kids so there's minor little milk stains on the leather so make sure we remove that as well as conditioning it conditioning it and then we're gonna do an exterior wash wheels and tires and it should be ready this package usually doesn't take me quite some time uh, but usually I'll say give me about two hours with the vehicle because I want to make sure they get you know um, everything done to it uh, no cutting corners on it whether if it's clean or not i like to just make sure i take my time on the vehicle so that's what we're going to be working on today so i'm just going to get set up and we'll be right back great what's today tuesday taco tuesday matter of fact today i'm doing a we're doing a giveaway for like the five five first people that show up uh to the stand i'm gonna be at they're gonna get like five free tacos so but uh while i'm working where'd he go got landon crawford with what's aqualux up? what's up um he's out here he he was literally like five minutes around my area but uh just swung by to to say hi to say hi but uh do you do one buckets or how many buckets do you do when you wash a car 30 buckets 30 buckets <laughs> <laughs> i don't use any buckets no buckets no buckets why why do i use no buckets because um, well, what do you do? How many buckets do you use? I just use one. Uh, oh, yesterday, good. somebody had asked me about that. Oh, yeah? Uh, I guess they saw that I put all my brushes yeah. and everything in my yeah. bucket. Um, but the reason I do that is, I mean, many people follow, like, many YouTubers. And obviously, they all have two buckets, three buckets. I think I've seen four buckets max. What's that, 20 gallons of water? About... You want but, me to carry 20 gallons of water on around the driveway? I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I just can't. I can't. But, you know, for me, I, I try to make it simple, just like Landon always makes things simple. I don't, I just like to just have one bucket. And of course, if you rinse it off as you go, you're cleaning it out. So you, when you put it back into your bucket, you're not putting dirt in there. Um, Cause I've literally had that same soap. Yeah. I think for like two days. Right. And it's still clean. I just rinse it off every time I put it back into the bucket. I rinse it off and keep going. Um, so I know somebody somebody had asked me if I don't do a two bucket. Yeah, I mean I have two buckets, but one of them holds all my wash mitts. Yeah, that's it. Like I, I do so, the glass, flip it over, and I'll do one of the panels. It goes in that bucket. And yeah. I grab the next clean wash mitt. So working clean. I mean, it's all up to you guys, depending. To be honest, it's um, your preference. Yeah, it's your preference. Don't oh, ever do. think you need yeah. four buckets. Cause I can't have four buckets. Knowing me, I yeah. throw it. I I just that probably all the buckets of water just fall off, literally. Yeah, but if you put what, okay, that is more soap than you need to do two cars. Yes, that's actually one ounce. One, I actually put one ounce on that well, one. That could get you two. Yeah, I two did one cars. car yesterday. That's what I have left. So I mean, I'm even like being generous. So probably three cars. Yeah. That's more than enough soap than you'll have. You got mm -hmm. more enough water. Enough lubrication. Yeah, I don't. So yeah, we're we're wasting water for no reason. That's the reason I don't. I don't like to have too many buckets. I foam it, one wash me the whole car, and I'm done. I rinse it off and, and dry it off. But yeah, uh, I guess let me get everything set up and we're gonna wash this car. Alrighty, guys. So uh, I already foamed it. As you guys saw in that previous video, uh, right now I'm using one side, right? So this is how I do it. If you want more buckets, that's up to you. So one side. I split the mitt half side, uh, 50 50, right? So I'll just come up here and with the one side of the mitt, I will do all one side. There's still enough foam on the other side. So now that I'm in the back, once I'm in the back, I'll flip the wash mitt and then this will be the clean side right here. So right now I'm using one side, doing the whole car. And literally, with this wash mitt, it's gliding. So you don't have to worry about like you're gonna scratch the paint or anything. So now all I do is flip it and bam, now I got the clean side. Now I'm gonna go to the other side and I'm gonna finish it off. Yeah. 
<laughs> but of course, it's up to you guys, depending how how you guys want to do it. You know, never think that if, if you want to do two buckets, three buckets, you know, it's all up to you at the end of the day. Uh, however, however you want to do it, guys, it is all up to you. And if you like the a wash pad, there will be a wash pad coming of the Ninja family. Right now, there's only this one with the where you put your hand in there. But it's coming, guys. I think somebody had asked, y'all, some of y'all prefer the wash pad, which I didn't know if it really made a difference, but if you're wanting a wash pad, it's coming. It is coming. And no, I'm not advertising because Landon's here. <laughs> I'm just being me. Um, and I, I like the watchman to be honest. It glides like no tomorrow. Um, short people problem. But uh, overall, that's how I do it. One side, we will obviously wash one side with the mitt, flip it over. I still have enough lubrication to do the whole car. And I mean, it's perfect guys. So that's how I wash cars. Hopefully you saw a little bit of how I do it. No bucket, one mitt. Flip it and that's it. And we're about to rinse it off. Yeah, this is it's not even dirty. Sometimes I laugh when I clean it. Alright, let's rinse it off. Alright, so Landon got it. And as always, I tend to um I'll rinse the wash me completely before I induce it into the bucket. So that's how I'm able to maximize one, my soap. Uh, two, not carrying too many buckets. I know many people wonder like, bro, why don't you have two buckets, three buckets? And that's just not, it's not me. And if, for those who know me, I drop everything or I'll just like, I don't know. I just have a bad habit of tipping stuff over. So. Literally, if I drop that bucket of soap, I will be mad because, I mean, that soap cost me a lot of money to drop. So, at the end of the day, you know, it's all up to y'all how y'all want to do it. But we're going to rinse it off. He's going to rinse it off and then we'll be right back with... The finished product alrighty guys so if you watched all the way to this video it's giveaway time giveaway time so if you left if you left I hope you came back or I hope somebody told you hey giveaway I know everybody loves giveaway so I'm gonna give a be given away um, to, uh, to two lucky winners um, I bought some uh, this one's the slurpee and the Slurpee Jr. All right, the Slurpee Jr. And, you know, somebody I'll be like, why would they name it Slurpee? I don't know. Because when I'm thirsty, I gulp that sucker, man. And you're about to see this towel. See why I, it's called the Slurpee. So look, two lucky winners. All right, I'm going to send you. Um, so both winners, I will buy. Um, I'm going to buy you a Slurpee and a Slurpee Jr. All right. And you're gonna have a combination. And these are amazing. This one is good. I tend to use both of them at the same time because I'll dry with this one and I'll follow up with this one. And bam, it's perfect. But, all right, let me show you guys. Uh, so hashtag Aquafiber, Aquafiber, all right? Remember the name, hashtag Aquafiber. Oh, and this time I'm doing it a little bit different. So I'm gonna make sure it's hashtag Aquafiber. Um, because this new thing I'm gonna be using if you don't do it correctly, it won't catch it I'm using it through YouTube. So bear with me guys. I'm learning different things. All right, so hashtag aquafiber um, And then hashtag slurpee Hashtag slurpee, but all right, here we go before this car dries up on me check this out and hopefully the camera can maybe catch a little bit of how uh, So look you literally throw it on there. This is a 1200 uh, GSM towel and look at that once you glide it guys 
bam no streaks nothing guys uh, obviously the car is white so you're not going to be able to tell and i know some of people are going to ding me like bro you can't see it yes you can't see it guys so i'm sorry so i don't know how you guys drive your cars and i probably do it the wrong way but that's okay guys that is okay all right so no streaks it drives on one pass guys and you just can't beat that literally this one for this car i can do the whole car and i can do maybe one or two more cars on a freaking nice damp towel and i'm okay all right so and then obviously um i'll follow up with the slurpee jr just to kind of remove the the excess of the water check the window out look how easy i love because i'm short so since i'm short i literally just throw the towel over raise the antenna up a little bit and bam look at that guys can't beat that and then just remove the excess i usually tend to dry the cars windows first all the way around windows first and then i'll just come back with my slurpee junior and dry it off that way i know the windows get sometimes hard because of the film or whatever uh and i am not using a di water um not yet but i haven't had any issues guys when it comes to uh drying a car just because this tends to stay uh wet so that's the reason i guess i haven't really thought about buying a di tank but the more and the more i see everybody buying these tanks it's making me kind of like like i'm behind but um I will have one here soon hopefully I'm gonna save up for it so in a video down the road you guys will see me with a on-the-go water tank why did I choose on-the-go because you can find that one at aquafiber detailsupply.com but regardless it was pretty much the first um, DI tank that uh, uh, Landon introduced introduced me whenever uh he got it he was like check this out dude and uh i mean it's a freaking cool thing to have especially if you live in a heat environment and you can be worry free that you're not a uh, you don't have to haul that i mean rush i was about to say haul ass but i don't want to i don't want to get dinged well i already said it so whoops <laughs> sorry kids but uh but yeah, um, but hashtag Aquafiber, hashtag Slurpee. Did I say Slurpee Junior? No, so hashtag Slurpee. So hashtag Slurpee and uh, hashtag Aqualux Auto Detailing uh, because this is, this is, uh, I don't know. For me, I'm excited for my buddy, for my friend. It's just freaking amazing. And no, I don't, I, I don't get a, you know i'm not pushing his stuff it's just the stuff will sell for itself is that good to be honest many of you guys will say oh well it's the same towel as everybody has and it's true but for me it's about quality and reputation and shipping i forgot two day shipping <laughs> and the packaging i mean if you guys have already ordered some stuff from him <laughs> and i think some of y'all may get his stuff here soon you're gonna see how that packaging comes which is amazing so today shipping guys when you order through the website get you guys you know get you a slurpee slurpee jr get you the ninja great products overall but i mean i'm gonna finish this car up and wait for the next one to get here so um the giveaway what is today today's tuesday so one week from today guys uh, i'm gonna choose the two winners you're gonna be going you're gonna be receiving a slurpee 1200 gsm all right edgeless i think edgeless and look literally it's already it's soaked but you can literally let me see if i can see it over here this is why i love this towel guys it's soaked but look no streaks once it dries, bam. And this thing is soaked. This is one of the reasons I love these towels, just because you can literally go back, 
dry it again and you have no streaks once it dries amazing so as always guys god bless y'all one week from today two lucky winners will, will be receiving a slurpee and a slurpee junior to have fun in your business um so if you've been looking for a towel hey enter this giveaway and uh i hope you win so overall god bless you guys i'll see you guys on the next video